there may be a lot of businesses in a situation like complete payroll, or maybe they're already offering it, but it's through a general bank of PTO that could be used in a variety of ways. Now they have to go back and prove that they're offering it uh, specifically for sick leave. Do you have any recommendations for best practices on how they would go about doing this? So it's going to be important that you have good record keeping. So for a couple of reasons. For one, the, your, the statute requires that if an employee asks, even verbally, as to how much sick leave time that they have, that you have to give that to them within three days. Okay, and so you also have a requirement under the statute to maintain the records for up to six years. So as far as the best practice, it's going to be important that you have a system in place that's able to comply with those things. And a further reason to consider breaking them apart would be what happens when an employee leaves at the end of their employment. So under New York law, an employer that uh, doesn't provide any rule as far as what happens with vacation pay is required to pay it out. With regard to this paid sick leave time, there is no requirement that it be paid out to an employee upon leaving. So it might be another reason to consider breaking the two apart.